Hello everybody, I've just filmed this eye video um, where I talked about where I've been and you know how, how I'm feeling with the situation in the world at the moment. So if you want to see that, it's linked down below. Um, I did before lockdown and um, si since lockdown I've been like trying not to order anything online, being really sensible about what I'm ordering, what I'm posting, thinking if it needs to, to you know, save like staff being exposed to stuff um i'm sure you understand what i mean I'm not very good at explaining it um but yeah i did a little order and it arrived the other day and i thought it would be nice to show you what i've ordered and why i've ordered it um i keep looking at this i, I feel like i need some sort of blush or bronzer on anyway <laughs> um i do really like this eye look though but yeah i ordered some hair stuff because basically i've uh, been, i'm growing my hair out as you can tell and um i've let it dry naturally today so it's got its like mad wave to it. This side's not too bad, but this side's always just like, oh, I'm going to curl under and do what I like. Um, but yeah, I'm growing my hair. I've had some breakage issues that I, I mean, my hair's always been a bit frizzy since I bleached it, um, which I've I've stopped bleaching it now. I only use this, like uh, this blue hair dye and like semi-permanent dyes, nothing with um, ammonia or bleach in it. No lightening products. But yeah, um, since I started growing it, I've had some breakage at the front. I don't know if you can see it. I'll zoom you in. I don't know if you can see where I'm talking about, but here. So if anyone else is dealing with this. I've had some breakage here, basically. I don't know if you can see. But yeah, so I've had some breakage. So I've, I use my glossy credits. Um, I'll link down below what expla it explains about the glossy credits. I use those to purchase some stuff on Look Fantastic. It arrived the other day. And... Um, I'm going to try this Shein Moisture. I checked that this was cruelty free. Um, yeah, it says on there. Yeah, Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Rescue Treatment Mask. It's got shea butter, peppermint and apple cider vinegar. And you can use it on naturally, chemically processed or heat styled hair. And it helps breakage and stimulates the scalp and everything. So I'm um, going to be trying that, especially where I'm indoors more often. I'm literally only going out to walk Bella first thing in the morning and that's it at the moment. Um, so yeah, I'm going to try and get my hair in better condition. I'm not going to colour it or anything. I'm just going to really focus on using lots of masks, getting the health back and then I'll probably do a darker blue and keep that for a while. But I won't be going back to bleach or lighter colours because I'm done with ruining my hair basically. But yeah, it's not looking too bad and it's getting really long as well considering how um short it was like a year ago my hair grows really quickly even though it's damaged so yeah so i've got that and i've also got to try a oh, i can't remember what this is called now giovanni two chic repairing super potion hair oil serum this is for damaged and over processed hair tick tick um it tames frizz and flyaways to find style and add shine smooths each tress helps prevent split ends and breakage that's why i got this one it's got blackberry and coconut oil in it and um it's got no bad stuff in it and it's cruelty free so yeah i went with that and i love the packaging it's so like expensive looking if that makes sense and i mean it's called chic so that makes sense um so yeah so i've got those for my hair and i've got one other thing for my hair um oh and a free sample for my hair as well so i'll show you that i got a bleach london beer mask um, this is a follicle fortifying vitamin hair treatment. Bit of a mouthful. But yeah, this is vegan and cruelty free too. I never realised that uh, Bleach London is cruelty free. So I will try... I, I used to use their hair stuff a lot. So I will try some of their hair dyes. And I'm going to make a few videos about that later in the year once I start dyeing it again. I've got hair on my face. It's really annoying. Um, that's the beer mask. Let's open this and smell it. I'll open the other one as well actually. Oh my goodness, you know, that reminds me of how hair products used to smell. I don't know how any other way to explain it. It looks like jelly. Oh, that smells so good. I wish I could explain the smell. But it. when I was younger, my mum used to buy this beer, beer two-in-one shampoo for after we'd been swimming called Linko. Um, and we used to be obsessed with it. If you used it too much, it dried your hair out. But if you used it like one off, like we did when we went swimming, it used to put all the like moisture back in your hair from the chlorine. Such good stuff. It smells a bit like that, which makes sense as it's beer. So yeah, so that's that one. And then I'll smell the Jamaican black castor oil one, which I think has got a seal on it. That I like, I don't tend to open stuff till I know I'm going to use it. But I'm going to use this tomorrow. So, um, or the next day. Oh, 
oh that smells just like shea butter that smells so good so rich i've just yeah i've just rubbed my hand right over anyway <laughs> a bit of extra moisture won't hurt my hands at the moment that's for sure um we're talking about i'm trying to get the made a right meal of that <laughs> just wrecked it <laughs> right anyway let's put the lid back on that why did i carry on ripping it off as well my hair's gone all because i roughed my hair up at the beginning right anyway my idea was that's why i've done the unboxing because there's not that many products but what i um will do is do a like review and i'll show you the di so i'm like this is for my reference well but if you can see this is all like broken off here so i really want to try and get this my hairline just, like stronger and like my hair to look more smooth and shiny so this record is for me as well as you and i can report back um how well these products work basically for breakage and dry damaged hair hopefully oh it's like a weird i don't know what that is but um yeah so i'm gonna report back how well these products work and what i will probably do is try one at a time um mask wise i'll use this one first and then i'll use this one and let you know how i'm getting on i'll do like a monthly update or something and i'll use this in my hair once once it's washed so yeah hopefully that makes sense <laughs> my videos are going to be all over the place at the moment i'm sure everyone can understand i just can't keep a thought together at the moment um this is the bond builder from philip kingsley it's a little sample so i'll use that and let you know when a product empties um now i was just saying oh no that's in the video that i deleted and i've got to redo don't ask had a coffin fit it's fine um i only ordered one of these melt me softly they're like no strip things but they're not peel off ones they're it like dissolves the blackheads it's the weirdest thing but they work so well that's what i swear by and i've my pores are a lot smaller now i only ordered one but they've sent me hello they've sent me four so that was good so yeah i've got those but these are the last like nose like any type of face mask is the last type i'm buying i explain my product empties which will be the next video um or the video after that something like that yes so when you get to <laughs> when i get to that i'll link it down below all over the place it's, i'm driving myself mad i can't imagine what it's like trying to watch me um this is the monu skin set i got a monu eye cream which i'll show you which should be in here yeah i got the monu eye cream in a glossy box i checked online and they are cruelty free um so that's really good and i think it's made yeah it's made in the uk which i thought was really good i really like that um yeah i got this eye cream you can't see it's the eye cool gel line smoothing cream from in a, from in a glossy box um and i really really liked it and i wanted to buy one ever since and then um i just forgot all about it basically but i needed a new day eye cream because i'm running out of my one that i really like and um i decided to repurchase this and then i saw on look fantastic they had the set like a skincare set so i've got the eye cream that i really liked which it actually like deep puffed under my eyes they looked really smooth um like all the time not just when i had the cream on or when i just used it if that makes sense they looked so much better and they've stayed really nice ever since as well because i used to have really crinkly hair but it's a much smoother um this is the warming aromatic mask this sounds really nice it's natural clay lavender and rosemary um so there's a mask so uh that's for my face obviously that's my eye cream and then this is a micro exfoliant um an in instant radiance i don't know it's might got microfine particles in it i'm not sure um how i feel about uh physical exfoliators i haven't used one for ages but this is supposed to be super super gentle so i'm going to try it and i'll let you know in a product empties how i get on with it or the little review or whatever um so yeah, i'm really excited to try them i really like one i'll link their website down below i'm so excited um uh, to find that one look fantastic it wasn't even what i was looking for and then there was a little kit and i was just like yes <laughs> um and then last of last and not least oh 
you know what I mean. This is the Mane and Tail Hoof Maker Hand and Nail Therapy. Um, I really needed something intensive for my hands. I'm using up all my odd bits of hand cream, but I'm running really low. And obviously, with washing my hands so much, they are getting really dry and crispy. So I'm going to try this. I really like the shampoo and conditioner, so I'm excited to try the hand cream. Um, yeah, so that's everything in my little haul. As I said, I'll do a month in a month's time. I'll do a check in on the hair stuff. I'll show you if my hair's looking any better, if it's working. Uh, please message me down below, uh, reply down below, comment down below, whatever. I what? can't even speak. Comment down below if you recommend any hair stuff for breakage, something that's worked really, really well for you. Um, yeah, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.